Have you been driving a lot and you've been sitting in your car due to traveling and visiting families and you need a gentle stretch on your hips and low back area? Hi, my name is Annie and welcome to my channel Annie Pilates Physical Therapist. Join me for a lovely evening or end of the day yoga flow to this session on your hips to lengthen and stretch tight hips with low back pain safely and effectively. So get your mat ready and join me. Okay, my friends, let's start in cross-legged position. You can place a pillow on your buttocks to help support your spine if you're really achy and you have to slowly release the tension off your hips. So with your cross-legged position, arms, palms open, we're going to slowly mobilize our hips by gently rotating our spine in one side, turning your eye gaze as you turn your head and body in one side, keeping your palms up, elbows straight as you breathe in, and then breathe out to the other side. Feel the gentle stretch on your upper back as well to release tension after sitting for a long time in your car, traveling, visiting families for the holidays. Inhale and then exhale back center. Feels so good all the way to your neck. Follow your eye gaze with the movement. We have one more rotation as you breathe in and you can fully stretch further as you go back and eye gaze following your shoulder blades tip of your shoulder with your eye gaze and you can turn your neck further and then back to the center with your palms down to the mat and slowly gonna slowly reach in one side opening your shoulders and your hips as you breathe in. Eye gaze towards your hand as well to further stretch your neck all the way down to your hips. Now place your hand now down to the mat and switch to the other side and reach over your right over your left. As you inhale, feel the release of your shoulders as well as your rib cage opening to take deep breaths in and then exhale down feels so good on your rib cage to expand with your breath work now switch again to the other side you can close your eyes so you can really feel your mind body awareness as you breathe in reach to one side diagonally and exhale back placing your hand down to the mat to switch to the other side one more inhale and then exhale back the next exercise is we're going to slowly stretch and place your top knee over your lower knee so my left knee is over my right if this is too difficult and you can't reach yet that's fine just slowly lift and cross over for a lovely stretch and you're going to feel a lovely release on your hip keeping your foot down if you can and slowly palms up again elbow straight and slowly turn your body again in one side and you're gonna feel a different kind of stretch on your hips as you inhale and then exhale turn to the other side slow and steady with your breath work breathe in and breathe out last turn slow and steady turn to the right and then turn to the left now reach your hands up to the ceiling with your eye gaze following your hand as you breathe in slowly forward fold i'm keeping my elbow straight as i fold forward to hug my knees in front of me Resting my forehead towards my knees as I breathe in and breathe out. Hold 
hold this in two deep breaths. Last deep breath in. As you exhale, slowly sit up straight so we can slowly switch to the other side. Gently release the tension of your hips. And this time my left knee under and my right leg over with my knee together, stack up together. And you're gonna feel a different kind of stretch. One side might be a little bit stiff and tighter. Again, your palms up open, slowly turn, releasing tension of your lumbar spine. Eye gaze following your movement as you turn right and then left. You can close your eyes if you like so you can feel the gentle release of your hips. Feels so good to release all the tension. Breathe in and breathe out. Last one, inhale and exhale. Now slowly reach up overhead, high gaze towards the ceiling. Take a deep breath in and slowly bend forward for forward fold and hug your knees and feel the deeper stretch. Two more deep breaths in this position. Last deep breath in and slowly lift your right foot up. Place your feet together, toes together, heels together, knees apart for a butterfly stretch. And slowly mobilize your hips by slowly turning your body in circles as you breathe in and breathe out feels so good on your hips and your spine two more rotations and now switch the circles from left to right close your eyes if you'd like to really feel the lovely release of your hips and your back Breathe in and breathe out. Last one. Now gently do a gentle pulses, lifting your knees off the mat like a butterfly wings flapping. Let's do this in five deep breaths. Release the tension of your hips, the gentle mobilization of your hip joints. Two more deep breaths in. Last one. And slowly lift your hands up towards the ceiling again. And gentle forward fold and reach forward as much as you can. If you can't lower your knees to the side, that's fine. As much as you can for a gentle butterfly stretch. Making sure you're Hinging through your hips, not your lumbar spine. You're not forcing your spine as you bend forward. You want to make sure it feels good. Make sure you know what's right on your body. Everyone is different. As you further reach your face towards your toes, if you can. Inhale and exhale. Last deep breath in. And slowly sit up straight and we're gonna do a single forward fold extending one knee we're gonna stretch your hamstrings your hamstrings are really tight after sitting for a long time in your car and slowly extend your arms palms up open and look up to the ceiling and feel the stretch making sure your spine is straight and slowly lift your hands in a prayer position overhead hands together and hands to your heart and breathe out now slowly turn your body one side turning my trunk to the left where my left knee is extended and slowly reach for your toes if you can't reach yet because it's so tight you can reach for your knees and slowly lower yourself keeping your back straight 
for a single leg forward fold and feel the deep stretch of your hamstrings. Extending your hands, reach over your toes with both hands if you can. Last deep breath in and we'll do dynamic stretching to trick our brain to release tension by overhead with one hand so my right hand is on the mat leaning to the right while my left knee extended and slowly lift my left hand away from my left knee to stretch and release tension of my left ribs as I breathe in and slowly sit up straight to reach your on your left toes to stretch your left hamstrings and then overhead with my right for a lovely circular motion semi-circle to further stretch your right upper back shoulders and rib cage breathe in and breathe out now you can further go down towards your knee slowly releasing and then lean again on your right elbow and then overhead stretch with my left to stretch my left ribcage and shoulder as I breathe in and then breathe out back to sitting to reach for my left toes and foot for a lovely stretch of my hamstrings and now I can further almost touch my chest towards my thigh and my head and forehead towards my left knee you want to make sure it feels right there should be no pulling pain on your back it should be all on your hamstrings inhale as you exhale sit up straight again and lean again on your right elbow lift your left hand to overhead stretch and release the upper back and this will help trick your brain to contract relax and release tension of your body last one to stretch on your hamstrings and then overhead stretch to a semicircle, make a rainbow all the way reaching to your toes. And now you can really rest your face and nose towards your left thigh. Breathe in. As you breathe out, sit up straight. And we're gonna switch to the other side with my left knee bent and right knee extended. Now keeping your back straight, you wanna feel your spine in a straight position, not leaning on one side, hands up, palms up, and slowly look up to the heavens, extending your hand and putting it together in a prayer position, overhead, and slowly place your hand to your heart and breathe out. Now close your eyes, we're gonna do some lovely dynamic stretching. Lean first towards your right foot with one hand if you like and you might feel tension and tightness especially the inner side of your hamstrings and lean as much as you can try not to hurt your spine lowering your elbow to your knee if you can to touch and then slowly trick your brain by leaning on your left elbow to the mat and then lift your right hand overhead to stretch your right rib cage this time and your right shoulder with your breath work take a deep breath in and then exhale reach towards your right foot for a hamstring stretch and then semi-circle on your left hand over and about reaching towards your left right foot if you can Close your eyes if you like, so you can really feel the release of tension of your hamstrings and your spine. And this time you might feel a little bit closer in your right knee and thigh muscles. And you might find one side tighter than the other, and that's normal. Now release again, sit up straight. Semi-circle and lean on your left elbow. Right hand lift overhead. Feel that lovely dynamic stretching as you breathe in and breathe out back to forward fold single leg and overhead stretch and you might feel a little bit deeper stretch 
towards your right hamstrings and now you can really rest your forehead if you can towards your right knee and then your chest touching your thigh muscles breathe in and breathe out slowly lift again we have one more set lean on your elbow overhead stretch feels so good off your shoulder and your ribcage exhale reach for your foot and overhead with your left and forward fold towards your right side this time and you're gonna really feel a lot of tension being released breathe in and breathe out now slowly sit up straight and now we're going to do a pancake stretch where you're going to open both legs apart as much as you can with your feet apart keeping your spine straight place your hands on your hips for a lovely rotation again in circles right to left to start with with your breath work and now let's do reverse from left to right Breathe in and breathe out. Now slowly lean on one side. I'm starting with my left foot to reach overhead with my right hand. And slowly forward fold in pancake position. And this time it's a little bit deeper stretch as you could challenge with one leg straight. When both legs are straight, it's a little bit much more challenging and it's difficult sometimes and it's okay if you can't reach for your foot yet we're gonna do a deep stretch on your hips hamstrings and your spine breathe in and then breathe out to the other side one more set and hold this in two deep breaths Lean on my left side this time hold it longer as you exhale, last set on your right. Now both hands and reaching for my toes. Grabbing the foot with my hand to help me anchor the stretch. Last deep breath in. And as you exhale, sit up straight. And we're going to do a lovely pancake stretch as you slowly reach your hands forward for a forward fold. Placing your hands down to the mat and crawl your fingers forward for a deeper stretch. You're going to feel it on the inner side of your hamstrings and lower your chest down if you can. And let's hold it in five deep breaths for a deep, deep stretch. Last deep breath in, slowly curl yourself up, pushing your hands up so we can sit up straight and slowly lift your legs up. And we're going to slowly lie down for a lovely hip mobilization on your back. Roll down to the mat and we're going to hug your knees to your chest. As you breathe in and breathe out, rock side to side as we slowly cool down now on this lovely yoga flow to the extension of your hips and we're gonna do a lovely circle this time now reverse circles rocking your hips in circles and now we're gonna place one ankle over your left knee for a figure four stretch and hug your both knees to your chest in a figure four position to stretch your piriformis muscles and you can rock side to side as you breathe in and breathe out. If this is too advanced, you can just keep your feet down and just push your knee out for a figure four stretch for those absolute beginners. Inhale and exhale, hug your knees if you can. Now let's switch to the other side. Left knee over, left foot over your right knee and hug your knees to your chest and rock side to side. Feel that lovely stretch on your hips, especially your butt muscle on one side. 
So this time I'm feeling my left glutes. I'm bending my left knee in the figure four position. My left, I'm trying to rock left and right if you can. If you can't rock yet, that's fine. You can just hold it in static position and just feel the deep stretch. As you inhale and exhale, now place both feet together for a butterfly position again, but this time lying on your back, pulling your feet towards your chest and feel that deep stretch in your hip groin muscles as you slowly rock side to side again. Inhale and exhale. Now grab your big toes with your hands and slowly lift your feet up your, with the sole facing up to the ceiling, pulling your knees down to the mat. And this happy baby pose rocking side to side as well. Breathe in and breathe out. Now gently extend your knees, toes pointing to the ceiling and feel that hamstring stretch and pulling your both legs towards you for a lovely forward fold lying on your back and hold that in two deep breaths. Breathe in and breathe out. Last one, slowly open your feet apart for a V stretch to stretch your hamstring and your inner hip groin muscles and hold that in two deep breaths. Last one. And slowly place your feet together and slowly roll up and that's it. I'm hoping you enjoyed my simple yoga flow through this tension of your hips and back. If you've been sitting a lot and traveling by plane or car, if you love this video and want to learn more about Pilates, yoga, physical therapy, health and wellness, please subscribe to my channel, ring the bell so you won't miss anything, like and share this video. Every like you give to my channel, you are supporting me. If you have any questions, suggestions or concerns or special video requests, leave a comment down below. I'll try my best to answer each one of you. I'll be relaunching my back masterclass for those who needed an extra hand and support. If you find this workout too difficult because I have a beginner program launching soon. Click the link below for early bird ladies for first come first serve basis. Always remember, be safe, be well, healthy. See you in my next video training. Bye!